A man's love of his art, a daughter's love for her father. Together, they're in a race against the clock. Fighting to overcome the effects of a deadly disease to complete a body of work. Trisha Takasugi is live in San Clemente with more on their remarkable story. Trisha. Well, Jeff, they are both artists, but the father's creative mind is trapped in a disease-ridden body. And now it's up to the hands and arms of his young daughter to translate and complete his artwork. How's that? I think you need to spread a little bit more, especially on the bottom. It's a truly unique artistic collaboration. The hands of a 13-year-old daughter carefully carrying out the artistic vision of her artist father, who can no longer use his hands. After he um, lost his ability to use his arms, I thought that maybe I could help him, like be a creative outlet, so I could take all his thoughts and put it on the canvas. 54-year-old retired Navy Captain Gerard Schoenfeld was stricken with ALS, Lou Gehrig's disease, last year. The degenerative illness is slowly stripping him of all physical abilities. Yeah, I'm sure not walking anymore. I don't have any real use of my legs. And you can see my left hand is, um, there's no dex dexterity left there at all. Because of that, Schoenfeld thought he'd have to give up his lifelong passion for painting until his daughter Ashley proposed the teamwork idea. You know, coming up with the words to describe what I'm thinking about and feeling. She's part of me already, so I don't know if it would work with anybody else. It's kind of difficult, but eventually I get what he's saying. So I think we're, we think alike a lot, so... So much so that their paintings are now signed G-A-S. Right, Gas, uh, Gerard Ashley Schoenfeld, so. Now, Gerard Schoenfeld is not sure how much longer he will have the use of his voice because of his disease, so the father-daughter team are hoping to complete enough paintings by the end of the summer to be able to have their own exhibition at an art gallery. Live in San Clemente, Trisha Takasugi, Fox 11 News.